made it. It's not exactly glamping. It's the way we like to do things. Oh, look, it's a baptismal. It is a beautiful morning out this morning. Here goes CJ, they just launched the boat. There he is. We're over there. Okay, let's go meet him at the docks. We had a little bit of trouble with the boat. I got it. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Oh. The video is more important, Dad. Just the best using duct tape. We had a wing. We got that fixed, but now the motor's knocking, so that's not good. So we'll see if we'll be using the boat some more. <laughs> Probably not. Fished around for a little bit uh, with the trolling motor, but we finally brought it back up. And that, as you saw, it was a little bit of a hassle to actually get it back on the trailer without the motor. Uh, but uh, we'll probably do some bank fishing now. I'm gonna head back to camp and get some lunch. Hey, Mike, come over here and help us get all these fish out of the boat. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we got back and had some lunch and we've chilled out and sat around for a little while with the other guys. CJ and Alberto went down to do some fishing, so I'm gonna go see if I can go find them. See if they're actually catching anything. <laughs> we'll see. Did you find anything? Yeah, I'm playing with a bass over there. Playing with it? Yeah, it was. Wasn't interested? Nope, not been on finesseing and everything and he just... Oh. He didn't care. Didn't care, huh? How about that? Alberto! <laughs> nice. Yeah, that feels good. Attempting to take the valve cover off and see if they can detect whether or not a rod was actually bent or thrown or something like that. Eh, we'll find out. I'm stuck on something. The air filter. There we go. Oh, it's the uh, line on the side. Uh, That's that line right there. That line. I don't see anything there. broken. These are rods. So tent, another name for tent is called dwelling place. The Greek verb in the phrase, he will dwell with them is skanu, for which the standard translation is to pitch tents or to pitch camp. Yeah. So it would be cra crazy to translate Revelations 21, three, God's tent is now among the people and he will camp with them. That's cool. So yeah. hmm, I thought that was pretty cool. Our heart becomes the dwelling place because we ask Christ into our heart, right? Right. So we have to be careful where we pitch our tent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We have to be careful where we put uh, our heart. Uh, whatever we're invested in is what we'll spend our time with. Yeah. Okay. Whatever we're invested in, whether good or bad, is where we're going to spend our time. Is he going to be happy with where you pitch your tent? Yeah. Yeah. You got you got to pitch it on solid level ground too. Exactly. Well, we are doing some bank fishing, trying to make the most out of our situation with the boat. <laughs> but it's very pretty out this evening. We're gonna do some night fishing, see what we can catch. Maybe some catfish. It's just nice to be out here on the bank in the nice weather and the pretty sunset.
Better looking than the Morning. The groom. <laughs> Morning. Yeah, you better not ignore me. And Matthew would always ask, does anybody want any more? And if we meet You guys tell everybody about the monster fishes that we caught last night. <laughs> Alberto just looks away. <laughs> we didn't catch any fish last night. So we're gonna eat some breakfast and a little mint. We're packing up camp. We're gonna stop by another lake on the way home to try and see if we can have any better luck out there. Um, so we'll see. We're gonna get the tent tore down and all that and get it put away. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's it. The other guys went down to the water, but I don't like skipping meals and I'm hungry. So I'm eating a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Okay. Let's go for a hike, see if we can find where the guys went. Marco! There they are. Look at this bewildered old man sitting in his chair in the middle of the woods. Is that your cabin, sir? Oh my lord! <laughs> <laughs> you think there's a still in there? Might be fun to go explore. This is a crazy cool hiking trail. Might have to bring Rachel and the kids out here. Mike, what's your what's your favorite part of the trip? My favorite part of the trip, this right here. Sitting in the chair, <laughs> outside Enjoying in the middle of the woods. nature, yep. 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 I like the food. The food. <laughs> food. Enjoyed your corned beef this morning. That's right. Okay. Corned beef, no corn liquor. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, not on camera anyway. <laughs> you say. Uh, <laughs> I caught a bass but I failed to take a picture of it. <laughs> and so I have no proof. <laughs> it's like a two, two and a half pound bass. So anyways, if it fell off the bank back into the water. Um, but that was the best luck we've had the whole time. Uh, time to head home though. Well, the whip, it's <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Not a good idea. So I guess the lesson we learned this this trip was that uh, life does throw some curveballs, and we have to learn to to keep our mind renewed. We talked about that in a couple videos back, and you know, carnally, if we had not kept our minds focused on just spending some time in the presence of God this weekend, then this it could have been a disaster. It could have been awful. We could have just thrown fits and just packed up and headed home just because. You know, it seems like, well, what's the point? Well, the point really isn't just to be catching fish and riding on the boat and all that. The point is to be together and be hanging outside, a bunch of guys together and eating off a campfire and sleeping in tents and all that. So anyways, we had some really good devotions and some good times, some good conversations, lots of laughs. And so that's what's really important is just time together. Uh, but I think that's gonna be it for this video. You guys are loved and you have a purpose. We didn't break the boat. CJ tore the motor apart after we got home and found a washer in one of the cylinders. Thankfully it didn't do any damage and so he got it put back together and it is working. So we're good. Mm -hmm.